This video will cover the different kinds of color schemes that the system can create. By the end of this video, you'll understand the difference between baseline and dynamic color schemes and know when and how to apply different color schemes including baseline, user color, and content color schemes. One type of color scheme that Material provides is a baseline color scheme, which can be thought of as a design theme that does not take color dynamically, such as from the user's wallpaper. Products may adopt a baseline color scheme as their default scheme in absence of dynamic color. Baseline color schemes are created using the source color to scheme process. However, unlike dynamic schemes which extract their source color from an image, baseline schemes use a static, hand-picked source color. Additionally, a baseline scheme may have other bespoke design adjustments. Material 3 also provides an M3 baseline scheme for third-party apps. M3 Baseline uses a purple source color to derive the scheme, which creates an easily identifiable default or stand-in for dynamic colors. The other type of color scheme that Material provides is a dynamic scheme. These schemes' colors are derived from dynamic sources, such as the user's wallpaper or in-app content. Products may adopt dynamic color schemes in place of or together with baseline schemes. Dynamic color schemes are created using the source color to scheme process. However, unlike baseline schemes, whose source colors are static, dynamic scheme source colors are extracted from a user's wallpaper or in-app content. As these sources change, so do the dynamic schemes and thereby the colors which are applied and appear in an app. The first type of dynamic scheme that Material provides is the user color scheme, which is derived from the user's device wallpaper using the source color to scheme process. The second type of dynamic scheme that Material provides is the content-based scheme, which is derived from in-app content using the source color to scheme process. Between baseline and dynamic schemes, teams have a number of color sources to choose from when applying color to their product to create a rich and practical experience for users. A baseline or user color scheme should be thought of as the foundational scheme that is applied consistently and comprehensively throughout a product. On top of this foundation, a product may apply a content color scheme to contain spaces in the app, such as a set of components or a particular screen. 